Hello, welcome to another tutorial. In this one, I will be showing you guys how to play the Call of Duty 2 single player in Windows 7. Now, if you're having a little bit of trouble, you're more than likely getting this error when you try to play the game. So, you can get this up. When you double click the drive, you hit run game, you'll hear your disk spinning, and it will load the Activision thing and check it out. You'll hit play single player, you'll hear it reading the disk, and then kaboom! Oh no! That happens. So, what you want to do is it should install fine, and then once it's installed, Hopefully, you would have had um, some icons, shortcut icons, placed on your desktop if you select it. If you didn't, you want to go into your program, into your C drive, which is this one, and uh, program files, and Activision, and you want to click on Call of Duty 2, and then here you've got the single player and the multiplayer. Uh, short uh, applications, you want to right click the single player application and hit send to desktop to create a shortcut and then at your desktop you should have the single player shortcut all you have to do is right click that hit properties, compatibility and run it as administrator hit apply, ok and the game should open up. There we go. Ta da! So, that's how you do that. And I have the feeling that if you run it in compatibility mode for Windows XP, it doesn't work. Yep, yeah, there we go. So, you have to have compatibility mode turned off and it running as administrator. And then it works. So, I hope this has solved a load of problems for everyone. And now you can play your Call of Duty 2 again on your Windows PC without any problems at all. So, this is the end of this video, and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye!